Jacobians of partial function. Now in this chapter we are going to learn a new operator called Jacobian as an application of partial differentiation. Jacobians are useful to find partial derivatives of certain type of implicit functions to determine independence of function etc. Jacobians are also useful to find areas by changing the variables. Now Jacobians according to these Jacobians are consist of three types. Now the first type include the basic one finding Jacobians. The second type includes three variable. The third type includes Jacobian of a function. I will repeat the types. The first type is finding the Jacobians which is a basic type. The second type is a Jacobian of a composite function and the third type is the three variable Jacobian. So how to find them? We will be discussing each and every type one by one. So keep watching the video to get a better explanation and a better understanding. Now my first type of Jacobian of partial differentiation include the basic type of two variables. Now it includes two types like we, we have to ask to find Jacobian, Jacobian inverse or multiplication of both. So for that we need to understand what is Jacobian and how to find it. Now Jacobians can be find using three steps which is the first step of finding Jacobian is finding the partial derivative of u with respect to x of u with respect to y of v with respect to x and of v with respect to y partial derivative of all force all these four terms okay after finding this partial derivative we will solve the determinant where u x u y will be the first row and v x and v y will be the second meaning the first element of the determinant will be dou u by dou x the second element will be dou u upon dou y the third element will be dou v upon dou x and the fourth will be dou v upon dou y and after forming the determinant we will just simply solve the determinant and we will get the Jacobian now for finding the inverse Jacobian j dash there are three steps as well the first two steps are similar but the we have to find here do x by do u not do u by do x so we will replace like interchange the value where in jacobian i have to find do u upon do x in jacobian inverse i will find do x upon do u do x upon do v do v upon do u do y upon do v so these will be the scenario and will similarly frame the determinant and solve the determinant we will get j dash that is Jacobian inverse now when when we solve the when we when we multiply both Jacobian and Jacobian inverse we should get it as one okay so Jacobian and Jacobian inverse product is always one so this was the first type which is the basic type I will be solving sums on this type which will get give you a clear idea about the Jacobians with basic functions of partial differentiation.
for notes, like my Facebook page, Instagram page, and get notes on a Facebook and Instagram page. So you can download it and yes, share it among your friends because a friend in need is a friend indeed. So like, share, subscribe my video and keep watching. Don't miss it.